big mess right here. It's nothing but my project. And a speaker. Adios, amigo. Powering off. A lot of stuff going on in here. So this is like one of my project. It is actually very hard to do this. I'm actually going to be closing this and I'm going to start my other works. Because I've been doing this for the past three days and right now I'm having holidays and it's four or five days and I used three days just to do this like just to do this this thing and these like the small squares and stuff just three days for that and I didn't complete anything else so then I'm gonna complete the other stuff and let this rest yeah so I'm cleaning the space so yeah this is all I could do I was able to Okay, the light doesn't make any difference I have to do my texture clock and swatches like literally what I do in a day and how I feel about it so that is it so now I'm going to be using my markers Posca markers and some sketch prints I have color pencils and fill this up so actually about the texture clock I, it was totally wrong and the paper was really dirty so my teacher asked me to redo that and I added patterns not textures so I redid that and got approved all right okay the next work we have is watch me five minutes to complete 10 of these so now I have to turn everything into a specific thing according to the color I chose so I chose blue so yeah let's see
I mean, you can't say it's totally wrong, but it is right, but also wrong. So you have to use paint and mix it with other colors and create a swatch. If I'm choosing this little mirror, I have to like add gray and other type of blue, white, mix it and then create the object's color. But what I did was just use color pencils and sketches to do that. So it wasn't quite correct. I wasn't asked to redo that, but was given another assignment to do that. So yeah, that's settled. That's all for today, guys. I won't be doing anything else today. I am gonna go sleep. So thank you for staying up late with me. Bye bye. So guys, I'm going to be started, starting my work right now, so I'm going to be doing this today, because tomorrow is the submission for that, and I have to do this whole side, so yeah, let's do it. So I went to the shop and got some... White cement. Container. So I asked him for red, but he gave me orange. Like, bro. I asked you for So now I'm going to be doing the white cement. Ah, shit. White cement project. So. looks 20 of them now we have to mix the white cement
done with my tessellation work. So this is how it looks. So I don't know, bro. Like I cannot do this. I don't know how how to do this because this has a top, high elevation, and I cannot like increase it like like that. It'll look really dumb. So I think that's it. I'm gonna remove this. Wish me luck. I feel like, I don't know bro, this is like, if you look at it from distance, it looks very neat, but then if you like look it up like close up and stuff, you can see it's really clumsy and stuff, so I don't know. Let's hope for a good results. This is the design of mine. So I have to do some little corrections here, here, and here, here, yeah, so mostly this place, and the tessellation, I work. Oh my god, I'm, really, I'm actually really proud of this. I'm going to go sleep right now, I'm really sleepy, so yeah. That's it for this vlog, a day in the life of a design student. It's not much, but yeah, little details of what I do in a day. Like every day, this is what I do. So hope you learned something from this. I don't know what I'm talking about because I'm just sleepy. So yeah, bye-bye. See you in the next video.